Entertainment Luxury. Domini Ebunalua Agulu, born July 2 ND 1991, better known as Burna Boy, is a Nigerian singer, songwriter, and record producer from Port Harcourt, River State, Nigeria. Burna's artistic journey began at the age of 10, when a friend gave him a copy of Fruity Loops, a popular music creation software that is now known as FL Studio. With this software, he started making his first beats on an outdated computer. Burna creates music in his own genre, Afrofusion, which is influenced by Afrobeat, reggae, pop, and dancehall. He ascended to prominence in 2012 with the release of Like to Party, the lead single, off his debut studio album, LIFE, 2013. In 2019, he won Best International Act at the 2019 BET Awards and was named an Apple Music Up Next Artist. At the 63rd Grammy Awards in 2021, his record Twice as Tall won for Best World Music category. Today we'll be taking a look at the top 8 luxury buys of Burna Boy. Before we start don't forget to poke that like button and subscribe. Number 1 Lagos Home Burna Boy's 7-bedroom home is located on a stunning estate in Lagos, Nigeria's creative and commercial hub. The two-story Lekki Mansion is located in busy Lagos, a megacity with 20 million citizens. A tranquil 13,000-square-foot paradise. The huge building has a relaxing beige and gray facade and all the trademarks of modern luxury living. The inside features lofty ceilings, a private cinema, lounges, and a game room. There's also lots of garage space and towering windows. The 3,700-square-foot structure is separated into two unique sections. One portion has a recording studio, a gym, and guest artist bedrooms. The other is a more intimate setting. It's where he hosts his closest friends and has his own principal bedroom suite and private patio. I know fee die for nothing. Number 2 Lamborghini Urus, Burna Boy gave himself a fairly costly automobile. He posted images on Instagram of his Lamborghini Urus costing 250 million naira. According to Carmark, Burna Boy's 2022 Lamborghini Urus, Novatec Edition, has been updated by the Novatec Group, increasing its power and changing its stance. Already with a garage full of exotic cars, Burna Boy knows how to treat himself to pricey gifts. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year Domini. God loves you, your family loves you and I love you. You don't need nothing else, he captioned one of the photos. Number 3 Cannabis Brand, Grammy Award winning singer Burna Boy, has developed a cannabis brand named BRKFST, in association with Jokes Up Ice Cream, a Los Angeles, California dispensary. The brand's opening, which coincided with Miami Carnival, began with a pop-up shop, and continued with brunch at a South Beach eatery. The moniker BRKFST was inspired by the Nigerian singer's famous single, Last Last. The phrases, not nah everybody go chop breakfast, are Nigerian slang, which suggests that everyone will undoubtedly endure grief or heartbreak. He also says, I need Ibo and Sheo, Sheo, to heal his emotional wounds. Ebo is cannabis, and Sheo is alcohol. Burna Boy has always been open about smoking marijuana. In a 2021 interview with Homegrown Radio, he revealed that everyone in Nigeria uses marijuana, but they are hypocritical about it. It is not zero tolerance. It seems like everyone does it, yet no one wants to be seen with it. It's just so hypocritical out there. Everybody smokes weed, he explained. For this life I live I want to be celebrated, don't want to waste my days, I want to spend them on enjoyment. Number 4 Mini Documentary, Burna Boy tells the heart-wrenching story of his hometown of Port Harcourt, Nigeria, in the mini-documentary, Whiskey. The hard-hitting mini-documentary depicts compelling images of ongoing pollution, flooding, and general neglect in his birthplace of Port Harcourt, Nigeria. The mini-doc includes first-hand accounts from members of the community, such as an inconsolable mother who tearfully recounts the death of her son due to illness caused by pollution, and a lack of medicine, and an elderly truck driver complaining about the bad roads, which have claimed the lives of people who have no choice but to use boats to cross to the other side. Burna Boy went on to say, everything was a lot worse than the way I left it. 
The air was fully polluted, everything would be black when you wake up, even the cars. It's really what you see in the documentary. This is real life, everyday life for my people. I feel like we'll make songs about everything else, so why not make songs about what's really going on and what's really affecting the people in real time. Number 5 Fashion Collection Burna Boy teams up with Boohoo Man for his fashion collection, creatively driven by Burna Boy, the complete collection includes simple silhouettes, graphic tees and fresh, vibrant color palettes. The custom-created, Beat logo appears on matching sets, varsity bombers, and accessories throughout the line. The collaborative collection features a variety of trendy tie-dye, and one-of-a-kind acid wash designs. Bold, distinguishing colors such as brilliant green, a nod to the Nigerian flag, helping to diversify the product offering. The complete collection includes distressed denim, colorful, and vivid sweatsuits, and peculiar patchwork plaid. I couldn't see I was cheated on. Number 6 Jesus Pendant, Burna Boy reportedly gave fellow musician Fino, a multi-million Naira Jesus-themed pendant. Fino, real name Chibuzo Nelson Azubike, was photographed wearing the Jesus-themed pendant in a post shared by a social media user. We all hope for friends like Burna Boy, who is willing to spend a bit more for a friend's present. Whole time I was grinding I was trying to achieve, working night and day, you know my people no day sleep. Number 7 Jamaican Trip According to sources, Nigerian artist Burna Boy confirmed that he bought six Birkin bags for Jamaican singer Jada Kingdom. In a public declaration, the Afrofusion artist publicly professed his admiration for Jamaican girls, claiming that they have the nicest backsides in the world. In the official remix of Byron Messia's smash song, Talibans, the talented Nigerian singer was heard singing, Ah de best pum pum da ah Kingston, so me buy ah Birkin for Jada Kingdom. So me phone get ring down, me too rich now, so me buy six more. Number 8 Time Spent, he gave his old friend OAP half a million naira just for time spent. News spread swiftly, and became a major story when media personality N6, stated Berna's old friend received 500,000 naira for spending time with the singer in a nightclub. He rushed to social media to show off a video of himself calculating the money he received from Berna, captioned, half a million just to chill with my old friend. Baiko when is the next hangout happening? I, too, can come. If you see me tonight you can clearly see that I've been waving since morning. This is the end of Top 8 Luxury Buys Burna Boy. Make sure to tap the like button, and subscribe, to see our next list. Bye for now.